Thank you for tuning in to the Law Nation Film Session. As we take a deeper look at Tristan Hill, number 97. He was a rookie last year. And there's not enough tape to do a full assessment or evaluation for the nation. But we can just take a look at the film and see what he can do. They line him up at the, uh, at the one and he played some three as well. So he was that guy that we wanted and have to have high hopes and expectations on. But we just didn't get it. We didn't. We only have a sample size of, of tape out there on him. So I, I would say just looking at film, the small sample size is that, yeah, he will have to visit the weight room. Of course, strength is something that naturally is going to come to him, too. But uh, his point of contact, his point is not strong. He, he's not he don't have that, dare I say, strength yet. And of course, it would take time. It will flat out take time. Uh, he is a guy that's quick of his release, get up field real quick. He got all of those things. I, I like his quote unquote first step. And he uses his arms pretty well. But the problem is his strength, of course, and just time. I tell everybody it takes time. And on top of that, that is something that, that we will have to understand. It takes time for somebody like that to play against the big boys. You can do it all day in college, but when it's time for you to do it in the pros, it's just going to take time. Now, do the Cowboys have the longitude and latitude for his time for Tristan Hill? I can say, uh, I don't know. I just don't know. Oh, shout out to this play right here. You see how your boy number 50 come in there. Watch this. <laughs> all right, so they get engaged right here. Watch number 50 come crashing in. That's cold blood right here. He takes out and erase everything. <laughs> Watch how he 86 everything. That That's pretty good right there by, by number 50. Watch how he coming out. Mm. Let me help you out, Tristan. Let me get him down for you. <laughs> but uh, neither here nor there, uh, when we look at this particular uh, guy, number 97, you want strength, baby. You want to push that pocket back. Now, as a rotational piece, hopefully this year he will be the first guy in as the rotational guy. Look at him lining up at the one. Now, here's the thing. He's not going to get the penetration for the nation. No, he's, that's not his game. That's not his cup of tea. Where he wins with, at is, is technique, quickness, getting upfield, using that as a portion to get there. But... It took him forever to get this running back down. Of course, low men always win. Low center of gravity, one can say that. And when you look at that particular clip, you will say to yourself, man, oh man, can he just get the brother down? But shout out to uh, number 50 for getting there. And like I said, it's sample size, sample size of Tristan Hill. Not a lot of film. So this year, hopefully, uh, when everything will get back in order, hopefully, they can get this brother out there on the field so he can get the valuable time, the valuable reps, the valuable understanding of the game and these sort of things. Now, this play right here, uh, they counted this as a quarterback pressure. The quarterback was still able to get the ball off. I like the lateral movement along the line. That is something that you have to have the cognitive mindset to say, OK, I'm jammed up. Let me continue to move my legs, get downfield and get to the quarterback. That was pretty good. He literally moving laterally on the field. <laughs> not not a lot of penetration. Somebody got their hands on him. Number 67 and 76 wedged him inside. So he scooted out. He got some good speed. That's something that he, he had in college in 65 get his hands on him. He escapes from here. And he gets pressure. QB pressure. I just wish that 24 was able to track this ball a little bit quicker. Look. <laughs> If he tracked this ball a little bit quicker, maybe he can catch the interception. But uh, I believe that quarterback uh, put the ball right there, knowing that this receiver is tall. I think he's like six foot four, six foot five. He put the ball where only I believe uh, that, that the receiver had a chance at it. But outside of that, shout out to Tristan Hill on a good play, creating quarterback pressures. It's half the battle, and you want the quarterback to throw the ball off his marker. And on top of that, you want the quarterback to, to be rushing through his throws and things like that. Now, here's Tristan again inside. He gets upfield. Of course, they allow him to. And this is the play that killed the Cowboys all last year. Discipline. <laughs> 
boy oh boy they killed us with all type of draws screenplays and beyond and um coaching staff taught them to get upfield everybody mama's uncle cousin was fooled on this play <laughs> crashed down everybody got hit inside and that's just how it goes cowboy nation so when we look at tristan hill yes it's a project within a project yes it's something that we will have to say to ourselves hey it'll, it'll take time it will flat out take time Hopefully, coach is coach, and on top of that, he can learn something from the bridge guys, the McCoys, the Dentari Poe, those boys. Hopefully, they can show him some ropes to see if this brother can grow. And don't take it as, oh, man, law, you just not a fan of Tristan Hill or, or you don't like the Cowboys and these sort of things. No, that's not the case nor the scenario. I'm just calling the spade a spade. Dentari Poe and McCoy those are not long-term suitable fix right there those are band-aids that you put on remember the free agency you want to be able to utilize the free agency to help supplement the needs on this team you build through the draft and all I'm saying and all I'm saying is that yes Tristan Hill may be a dog down the line but right now we still need some reinforcement on the defense that's been my time i really thank you all for yours and remember you're listening to nothing but the best salute